cuss out a cop, spit in his face, stomp on the flag and light it up. Cross that line, it won't take long for you to find out. I recommend you don't. Got a gun that my granddad gave me. Well, that shit might fly in the city. Good luck. This is World News Tonight with Peter Jennings. Good evening. We begin tonight with a decision by a supposedly conservative Supreme Court. It's about free speech and a powerful symbol of the nation. The court ruled today that burning the American flag as a form of political protest is a right protected by the First Amendment to the Constitution. Justice William Brennan for the majority. The government may not prohibit the expression of an idea simply because society finds it offensive or disagreeable that would dilute the freedom that this cherished emblem represents. Two Reagan appointees, Antonin Scalia and Anthony Kennedy, both conservatives, provided crucial votes for the five-judge majority. Why you believe that people who burn the flag in America should be allowed to do so, uh, and yet you personally, if you had the chance, would send them all in jail? If I were king, uh, I would not allow people to go about burning the American flag. However, we have a First Amendment which uh, uh, says that uh, uh, the right of free speech shall not be abridged. And it is addressed in particular to speech uh, critical of the government. I mean, that was the main kind of speech that uh, tyrants would seek to suppress. Burning the flag is a form of expression. Speech doesn't just mean uh, written words or oral words. It could be semaphore. Uh, Burning a flag is a symbol that expresses an idea. I hate the government, uh, the government is unjust, whatever. You know, I, I sleep very well at night uh, knowing that I'm doing what, I suppose, what I'm supposed to do, which is uh, uh, to, apply, to apply the Constitution. I do not always like the result. Uh, very often I think the result is terrible, but that's not my job. Uh, I'm not king. These are facts, and facts don't care about your feelings.